Bar Home. John O'Brown here. I see we're actually live streaming today, so it should be really interesting. But we're gonna make the naked and famous, and it actually has Aperol in it. Which sorry, the bottle was turned around. My director failed to check everything out. Hopefully, my hair looks good. So it's it's a really kind of fun summery cocktail. This is great by the pool. It's called Naked and Famous. I know that some of my followers out there want me to actually do this one naked, but it was just too much for the public. I just you know didn't want to. I didn't want my um, my subscribership to you know grow to over a million just because I did the Naked and Famous naked. But anyway, I digress. Uh, four simple ingredients. Great thing. Another thing. Great thing about this cocktail too is that it's all equal parts. So it's really, really simple for a home bartender to remember, as long as you have the ingredients down, right? Okay, so it's, it's uh, three quarters of an ounce of each of these. So we'll take the Aperol. I love Aperol. Um, it's, uh, it was amazing over in Europe, the, the way that they used Aperol over there. So did fall in love with this. Great color too. You guys will notice that I have my Vucare right here too because we just shot another video with the Vucare. So I couldn't let it go to waste. Mom, don't watch because you'll probably think I'm an alcoholic, but I'm not. It's just I make, it a, I make really good cocktails for everybody. Okay, so then we're going to use some mezcal. And I know a lot of you out there are like, oh, mezcal because it tastes really smoky or just really smoky and people just are surprised by the flavor of it. But again, just 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 expand your taste buds. Go move out or try new things. Um, the balance of all the ingredients here really kind of uh, make that smoky flavor. It's still there, it's just more subtle. They're gonna add yellow chartreuse. So this is actually the elixir of love. Uh, it's a French liqueur. It was thought to be an aphrodisiac. I have no, no clue. So we're gonna put some of that in there. This is all three quarter of an ounce, right? And then we're gonna add some lemon juice. And this is fresh squeezed lemon juice. So we add that in here too. There we go, three quarters of an ounce of each. Put that there, add some ice. And then we shake. Shake about 20, 30 seconds. There we go. And then it's just really simple cocktail. You just pour it right over a cube into a double rocks glass. You see how much it looks like summer too. So it's really just a fun drink. And then, if you want, you can add a uh, little lemon zest over the top or uh, a coin, whichever. So we just zest it like that. Boom. There you go. Naked and famous. Oh no. Mom, I have two drinks now in front of me. What am I going to do? Let me try this one. Tasty. Bar home. John Brown. I'm out of here.